On this occasion we're going to create a watermark using Word and Paint. As you can see there's quite a few, a few steps that have to be carried out in order to do this. But each step is very simple and easy to do. So we're just going to go ahead and show you how to do this. Okay, to do this the first thing we're going to do is that we're going to open Word. I chose in Word but you can really use any word processor that has this functionality. We're going to start by inserting the image so we're going to pick insert picture from file. Okay, having done this, I'm going to select a picture that I have already uh, reserved for this. There it is. Okay. Uh, so I'm going to do some uh, minor formatting like centering and then with the picture uh, selected, I'm going to right click and I'm going to select a uh, format picture. I'm going to make sure that the picture tab is selected. There we go. And now I'm going to go to the color uh, list and I'm going to select from here the last option which is wash out or the equivalent. Once I have done this, I'm just going to go ahead and click on OK. So there it is, a little washed out. So now I'm just going to open up uh, the, the Word uh, window a little bit so I can see all of it. And I'm going to capture the screen. I'm going to do this by pressing the print screen key. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. There we go. Now I'm going to open Paint. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to paste the capture screen in Paint. So I'm going to do that by using the Edit Paste option. So there we go. Now I'm just going to move this around to center it and to have all the area that I want to keep as a watermark to be viewable. I'm going to open that a little. Okay, now I'm going to deselect it and then I'm going to reselect it. Okay, so that just allows me to specifically select the area that I want to keep as the watermark. Okay, now once I have done that, I want to copy it to the clipboard. So I do edit, copy, and that's done. Now I'm going to create a new file. So I'm going to go to File, New. When I do that, what is going to happen is that it's going to ask me, do you want to save changes or not? I definitely do not want to save changes. The image that I want is in the clipboard. So now with the new image, I go ahead and I do Edit, Paste, and there we go. Now all I have to do is just save the image. So that opens the Save dialog. I navigate to the folder where I want to save it. There we go. And now I'm just going to put in any name that I want. Okay, having done that, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to save it. And there you go. That's how you do it. Creating a watermark with Word and Paint. Thank you.